you what's good guys medical gamer over here bringing you a pokemon sun and moon brand new news video now i'm gonna just tell you right now so i was in class when this announcement happened but i watched the video and so now i'm gonna bring a little bit of just like reaction kind of of what this video is just talk about each of the components and then i will be bringing a second video to you guys in a little bit basically breaking down both this and the japanese trailer and analyzing both of them trying to show you things that you might not have seen because there have been plenty of channels that have already done reaction videos i know that because it's 11:50 right now roughly um eastern standard time and the announcement came at 9 a.m eastern standard time so this is like three hours after but i'll just be doing a, a little bit of reaction and then the next video will have the breakdown with everything so without further ado let's get to it so pokemon partner so we have all the evolution so i'm not going to play through the entire thing because i don't want to get copyright just for like not even playing through the whole thing so we have dark tricks which is grass and flying still the middle evolution as you can see of rowlet we do have tora cat which is the middle evolution of litten so it's walking on all fours so that's interesting because in the chinese leak which i will talk about in the next video it's like a wrestler on two legs. I, I'll be talking about that in the next video, but I just wanted to point that out a little bit there. So Toracat, and we have Brion, the water type with uh, the ability Torrent, and that is Poplio's middle evolution. So now over here we have this festival area. So you can earn festival coins by fulfilling other players' quests. So this is almost like an overworld where multiple people can come in because if you see in the video you can see a few players like teleporting in so it's like an mmo kind of but it's just for this one area so it's not like a complete mmo rpg it's just for this one area you can fulfill other people's quest and then you can spend it to do i believe i think that it, this is going to be like ev slash iv training that's how you're going to do it in addition to the bottle caps um, because this, it's like, oh, do this so that you can increase the base HP of Pikachu. That's what they're showing right here. Pikachu had a blast. So things like that. And then you can also spend it on other things like um, items and stuff like that. Like you'll see right here, you have the festival coins using an unusual product, which contains a PP up or a Kalo set, Unova set, Sinnoh set, Hoenn set, Johto set, all that good stuff. And now we have a paradise for pokemon in our pc so basically pokemon in your pc will now be able to do things rather than just sitting in the box which is really really interesting i think that's a really great idea pretty unique for them to do this so island Ab isle of beans lets you attract wild pokemon that can join you and then you can capture them and island uh a fun allows your pokemon a uh, fun that's funny uh funny fun a uh, fun <laughs> lets your pokemon search for valuable items so you can get items like the leaf stone dust stone float stone shiny stone so stones that's what it's looking like and you get isle evil up which lets your pokemon train so increase their stats and you can also give them drinks to increase um different stats like special defense speed all that good stuff now mega evolutions are back in the game so i did make a previous video saying that mega evolutions were confirmed and now it's 100% confirms that they are back and it looks like the Z ring will allow you to do mega evolution as well now Whether it will allow you to do one mega evolution and one Z move per battle that is yet to be determined I feel like you have to pick between the two because don't you guys think it'll be way too OP if You can have a mega evolution and you can have a Z move on one team. That's literally that's just like so OP but We'll see what happens, and we don't know yet. So, Mega Lucario, um, they're showing off uh, Mega Salamence and another Mega. And they also show off Draco Meteor, which actually looks pretty cool. Look at that. Coming in, coming in, getting the Talon Flame. And uh, special demo version, October 18th. Now, I'm so, I'm so hyped for this. There, I'm letting you know right now, there are probably going to be, like, Chinese hackers slash leakers or you know any ethnicity not necessarily Chinese but they're going to be data miners that will look at these demos and they will get a lot of information from these demos unless if Game Freak did a very very good job with this demo now we did see in a previous uh, I'm not sure if I made a video on it but there were there was rumors about um, some some country I think it might have been Japan um, or Korea or something like that that um, had a post like a rating for the demo version of Sun and Moon So we did have an idea that the demo version was coming out But now it's officially announced October 18th and 
in the demo version, you get Ash Greninja. That's crazy. Literally Ash Greninja. So that means that there aren't necessarily Z forms per se, as some of the leaks have said, but Ash Greninja has an ability that when you knock out your opponent's Pokemon, it will transform into Ash Greninja. So I don't know if this is only for Ash, like if this is only for Greninja, or if it'll be for like the starters' final evolutions. I have a feeling it's only for Greninja because it's a special ability. It's not like a, uh, it's not like a stone or anything to allow it to do this. Or it's not like oh, when you use a Z move, it's gonna turn into Ash Greninja. No, it's an ability that Greninja has that allows you to knock out a Pokemon and it for to transform into Ash Greninja. So that is the entire channel. Cha that is the entire trailer. I combined trailer with channel and got Trannel. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Once again, I will be bringing another video to you guys. Hopefully soon, I have an assignment that I have to do. So after that, I will work on the next video. Just kind of breaking down. There's a lot of stuff that I noticed people on YouTube have not pointed out. So I will be bringing that to you guys. But I hope you guys enjoyed it. If you did, please hit that thumbs up down below. Subscribe. All that good stuff. I'm going to get out of here. Peace.